Hi, beautiful. Today is such an exciting day. You get to meet the newest member of my family, my little puppy. Her name is Saya. She is a little Yorkie Pomeranian mix. She's the most adorable little angel ever. Why don't I just go get her and actually show you guys? I'll be right back. Oh, my little girl. This is your debut. She's so hyper right now. Are you a hyper little girl? Oh. Oh my god, she looks so cute on camera. Oh. Her name is Saya. She is 14 weeks old. Oh, and she is just a little angel that I am obsessed with. I want to just hug her and love her all the time. I like when she's calm. You know, she is a very hyper dog. She's a Pomeranian Yorkie, so it's a lot for me sometimes. But she is such a good girl and she is acclimating so well and she loves her daddy even though she's not showing it on camera right now. She's like, no, I don't like my daddy. She's also like, what the f are we doing on camera right now? This is your new life. Today, we're gonna find out if little Saya here is a future hairstylist. Is she gonna have a career like her daddy? We're gonna see what her hair taste is like. We have to teach them young. This is part of her training with me. She has to know how to pick the correct hairstyle for the face shape, the correct hair color. We're gonna work on that later in her life. We're just gonna gauge what her taste level is at right now. She'll be picking Miss Manny Quinn's brand new hair color, <gasps> haircut, and how I style her hair. So hopefully she makes some good choices and daddy approves of her choices. We can all live a happy, wonderful life. Stop! Biting me. You're gonna see more of Saya in a second when she chooses what haircut Miss Manny Quinn is getting. Let's get it started. Come on, we have to walk off set now, baby. Come on. We have our three haircut options laid out for us. We have one that's a bob. We have two that is a sort of a mullet style, very shaggy haircut. And then we have a look with bangs and a very layered long haircut. So Saya is going to be released in a second. She's gonna choose which one. There is a piece of dog food on each of them. So whichever one she chooses is the haircut we go with. Hopefully it's the mullet. Come here. Oh, she's distracted. <laughs> go, Saya. Oh, you want that one? You like Taylor Swift, baby? <laughs> Mama, she wants number two. Oh, you just pick that one first, baby. That's Daddy's favorite. She hates the bomb. What do you think of your choice? Oh, she loves this one. Hi, Miss Manny Quinn. So, Saya, yeah, my dog. Yeah, she's new. Yeah. She's really cute. Uh, she chose this hairstyle for you. It's a Taylor Swift look. She has a lot of layering with um some bangs. What? You don't want bangs today? Well, you're getting bangs. Just shut your mouth, you know? And I hope you like your look because you are not allowed to make a peep or make any decisions on what your look is going to be. So I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna simplify this haircut as much as possible right now because honey, we don't have all day. We're gonna make it look cute, but you know, we don't need to have the best haircut in the entire world. So we're just gonna split this into four quadrants real quick. All right, we have our four quadrants here. They're um, not my best quadrants ever, but that's okay. We are going to take a little sliver of hair from over here. We are gonna keep all of her length because the look that Taylor Swift has, she has actually longer hair than this, but I'm not adding extensions today. And we're just gonna lift this up and give her some nice short, layers. Oh, that looks so good. So our shortest layer is right here and that is going to look fabulous. So let's just blend that in with the rest of the hair. Let's point cut a little bit on those ends. And I will be perfecting this cut once I dry her hair at the end and just make it look, you know, all put together. And now just to check the uh, haircut that is probably not that precise, I am going to comb out this section and just check it at a horizontal. And honestly, it's kind of precise. I am shook. Okay, Brad, work. And look at that movement we're getting now. I'm so excited. This is going to look amazing. I actually like that the ends are kind of like frayed and nasty because like that's kind of the look we're going for. A very chopped up layered moment. Okay, and here is our last section. It's quite big, but we're gonna go for it. Kind of surprised at how decently precise this was. It has that kind of shaggy feel. The ends are a little, you know, thin. You got a nice layering going on. I will do the other two sides, just like I did the entire back, and I'll see you then. People are gonna 
come for me with this haircut. I just did like the sloppiest haircut mm -hmm. ever. Now, Taylor Swift had bangs, so Miss Betty Quinn is getting bangs. However, I'm just gonna cut them across right now and then clean them up after I blow dry at the end and style them and, you know, fix them up. This is not gonna be that cute at first, so bear with me. We're just gonna go cut off the length real quick. Bye. All right, T-Swift bangs all done. She's looking real cute. Um, I'm gonna blow dry this real quick and get her prepped for the color. And then I'll bring Saya in to check out the cut and see if it's up to par with her standards and see if she likes it, you know? And if she doesn't like it, we're gonna have to redo it. So fingers crossed, it's good. Ooh, okay, Taylor Swift. We brought you, we did that. Um, I mean, it looks, <laughs> looks okay. What do you think about the haircut? Don't be too mean. The layers look choppy. Yeah, no, I get it. It's fine. What else? You think the bangs look like shit on her. I mean, that's not really that nice to say to Miss Manny Quinn. You guys just met each other. If you could be a little nicer next time, that'd be great. But overall, it's okay. We can move on. That's good to hear, I, I guess. I'm gonna do the color now. We're gonna pick the color. Yeah? Okay. So next up we have hair color. She is going to choose two different colors for me to use on this mini quin. So whichever two she chooses first are the ones I will go with. We have, you know, this beautiful bright electric pink moment. We have this virgin pink moment. We have lavender, we have red, we have blue, we have green. Let's see what she does. Please pick a good color combo. Hi baby. Oh. Of course, we have green and we have blue. Okay, honey, you're supposed to choose the one at random, not choose the one in the first in line, baby. Okay, so Saya chose aquamarine and iris green. It's an interesting color. I do like it. I just don't know how it's gonna look on this colored hair. I mean, Saya chose it, so it must be good. I'm gonna do blue on the top part of her hair, green on the ends, maybe like a green bang. We'll get creative with it. I'm gonna bring in my fellow hairstylist, Cassidy, to help me out with this just so it goes a little bit faster and I'm not here all day. Bing, bang, boom, bang, boom, bam. Just like that, teamwork makes the damn dream work. We finished the head in about five minutes. <laughs> She's looking nice and green and turquoise and aqua. It's looking real pretty. Hopefully the blue was dark enough for her roots, but we shall see. It might just end up like kind of a gray color, but that's fine. I'll work with it. We're gonna hope for the best, but expect the worst, just like I usually do. Okay, I'm gonna wait for this to process, rinse it off off camera. Okay, so I just rinsed off the color. It's actually looking really pretty, much more beautiful than I thought it was gonna look because her hair was not that light to start with. I'm really excited to blow dry this and see what it looks like. But first we have to get Saya to say this looks good or else I can't move on. I might have to redo it depending on what she says. But I think she's taking a nap. So I'm gonna bring her in here and hopefully she wakes up. She's like, why are you waking me up? I need your opinion though. Does this look good? Maybe you can answer me in your sleep. Do you like the way this looks? Oh, what'd you say? She said she loves it. Oh my God, what a little angel. Please have energy by the time I'm done. I need you to look at the final look. I'll have a good sleepies. I'm gonna finish the look off. Let's see what Saya chooses for the style. So she's going to be choosing between these three items. We have a curling iron, a flat iron, and a wave crimping tool. So she is going to pick the style that Miss Manny will get after her cut and color. Let's see which one she chooses and which one I have to make a beautiful style creation out of. Let's see what she does. We're gonna release her on this side this time. Hopefully oh. she just goes for the one that's closest to her. Good girl. <gasps> These are too easy for you. Hey, mama. Hey. <laughs> I will give this hair some beautiful texture and wave with the curling iron. And to prep the hair, I'm gonna use force field heat shield, of course, to protect her hair and speed up the drying time and make sure her style lasts. I'm also gonna put Viper smoothing oil in just to make her hair really shiny and really, really soft. Just right on her ends, mostly. This is going to give her high shine, baby, and make her hair feel and look so much healthier. Does her hair kind of look like a chic pile of seaweed? Yes. 
It does. Um, am I okay with it? If this was what she wanted, then this is what she's getting. <laughs> Her bangs look especially bad, but that's okay. It looks good enough, you know? But damn, her hair is so soft. And now we're ready to wave her hair. So I am just going to do my usual halo sectioning, which is just taking a big circle out of the center and leaving all of the perimeter down. And that's just like the easiest way to curl your head. It takes five minutes and you're good. And I am just going to start in the front. I am going to put it in, twist it halfway drop out, twist it halfway, and drop out. And it's gonna give me nice, beautiful, flat waves that will look so pretty with this sort of seaweed color we have going on. I'm like really nervous to see what Sai is gonna say about the finished look. She can be just really mean sometimes. I just hope she approves of it. Because if she doesn't, it's gonna ruin my entire night. And just like that, the perimeter is done. We're moving on to the rest of the hair. We're just gonna divide this into two back here and finish it off. And last layer, oh, I love waves because they make everything look 10 times better. Honestly, you could have a really ugly color and have really good waves and it'll make it look like your color looks fabulous. Still ugly, but we're gonna fix it. Let's shake this out and remove some of that wave because it is way too wavy, girl. Oh. Okay, that looks cute, but it could look even cuter. And of course, I pretty much always finish my styles with BDSM Slick and Fine Balm because it just adds that perfect amount of texture, especially in bangs. Like, I hate when they're too perfect like this. And I want to texturize them a bit because that is how Taylor Swift was wearing them. Ooh! Okay, okay, here is the finished look. This is the Taylor Swift inspired haircut with the blue and green color with the beautiful wavy hair style that Saya picked out. What do you guys think? Does it look good? I don't really know why I'm asking you because Saya's opinion is the only one that matters today. I'm kind of really scared. Let me go grab her. I hope she's nice. Okay, moment of truth. Saya. I need to know what you think of the final look. <sighs> oh, she's scared. What do you think? Oh, you love it? Oh, I'm so happy. She said she's living and she's obsessed with the look. She thinks it actually came out really nice and she said that she has great taste, but she said she already knew that. I would have to agree. You do have great taste, baby, just like your father and you're gonna be a great hairdresser. <laughs> oh my God, she's so cute. She's literally asleep right now. Sorry, I'm so distracted. I don't know why she's so tired. We didn't do that much today. You're so cute. Sai gave this a 10 out of 10. Thanks for being so sweet to me and not making me cry or have a bad day. All right, you guys, Sai needs to go to sleep and I need to stop annoying her. So that is all for today. I'm so happy you guys got to meet the newest family member of mine, Sai Amondo. How is there something in the world that this cute? You know what I mean? Make sure you guys follow me on all the social media networks, including Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Why are you biting me? At BradMondoNYC. You can also find my Facebook page and my Snapchat show under a Brad Mondo. That is all for today, guys. <laughs> Saya, say bye. Bye, everybody. Don't forget to live your extra life, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Oh, God, I can't reach the camera. <sighs> this is Electrified, our volumizing foam. If your hair is lacking volume, lacking body, lacking life, get Electrified. This is the ultimate cure for lifeless hair. This will actually thicken your hair strands and also add that bit of hold to your root area in order to maintain your volume all day long. 